The Andrews Anterior Instability Test examines shoulder joint stability. The patient lies supine with the involved shoulder abducted to approximately 130 degrees and externally rotated to 90 degrees. The clinician stands at the head of the table on the side of the involved shoulder. The examiner stabilizes the elbow and distal humerus with one hand and uses the other hand to grasp the head of the humerus. The examiner firmly lifts the humeral head anteriorly in an attempt to reproduce the patient's symptoms. This test is similar to the Lachman's test of the knee, but for the shoulder. A positive test is pain, apprehension, or excessive anterior translation, or a clunking sound when the test is performed. Look and feel for excessive humeral head translation. A positive test indicates anterior instability of the shoulder, which may mean the individual is at a higher risk for a shoulder dislocation as anterior instability accounts for 95% of acute traumatic dislocations. The clunking sound may indicate a labral tear. Be aware that posterior laxity may provide a false sense of anterior translation.